Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your daily vibes for Monday, June 18th. This is for all signs. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid. If you'd like to book a reading, the information is below. Daily energy for Monday, June 18th. Okay, so there's a, there could be a message coming in, a message of love. This could be new love, or it could be from somebody that you're already with, but this is a message of love, okay? It's unexpected, okay? It's good. Uh, it's welcome, and, you know, um, there could be a new opportunity. Somebody is offering you some love, perhaps, or you're offering it to them. You could be dealing with a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Could be dealing with any sign. Somebody doesn't want to be alone. Somebody does not want to be alone. Okay, I'm not feeling it. I'm not feeling this loneliness. I don't really care for it, you know. And therefore, they may be thinking, you know, that I want some love, so I may have to. Um, extend myself in some way it's time for me to look at something from a new perspective so that I can find the wish fulfillment that I've been hoping for instead of playing the victim somebody has been had living in a victim mentality and now they're deciding perhaps to to tell the truth tell how they tell what they want go after what they want um, Sorry, I just had a tractor go by. Yeah, somebody is feeling lost in love. Lost, like they lost out on an opportunity. And now they may want to apologize. They may want to... Uh, I feel as though you are going to be receiving a message, whether it's today, tomorrow, next week, soon, soon. Somebody is going to be receiving a message that... Um, restores their hope maybe even their hope and love okay i and it's it's what they've been waiting for i feel like there has been a lost opportunity and somebody has sees it they see and now they they are finding their 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 moral backbone to take charge and you know i think that whoever this person is has has gone through some sort of emotional upset in their life and they may have needed to go through a time of solitude, of being alone, to regain their composure, regain their self, to become aware of, of who they are and where they're going and, you know, the whole nine yards. But I just want to get this zoomed in before we go any further or focused, however you want to call it. That was at 3.33. When I looked at the clock, 3.33, your prayers have been answered. Your prayers have been heard. They may not have been answered yet, but they've been heard. Okay, 333. Um, there's been a lot of growth. Three is the card of the Empress as well. It's, there's been a lot of growth here. Somebody has went through a period of growth. And this period of growth was probably, you know, a time of withdrawal. Okay, I needed to withdraw so that I could become aware of who and, and what and, you know, all of that. So I feel as though, you know, there could be a message coming in, a message that you've been waiting for. Um, could be a new one as well, somebody from a new suitor. But somebody, um, yeah, somebody doesn't want to be alone anymore. I've decided I don't want to be alone. I mean, I don't, I have decided that I don't want to be alone. This is not fulfilling my wishes. Therefore, you know, I've been through, I've been through a bunch of, uh, of, uh, loss during this time without love. Okay. Somebody has gone through some sort of chaos, upheaval, um, disappointments in their life. 
and it feels like now they're deciding to to move forward they're deciding to take action in regards to what is the right thing to do somebody is about to do what they need to do that which involves their heart I'm about to follow my heart but it could be too late it could be too late somebody may be deciding you know I I see what you have to offer and I understand that you know maybe you have changed but I'm not sure that I can even consider you at this time somebody is maybe offering you love but you may not want it you may not want it because they withdrew they didn't communicate they may have given you the silent treatment you know because they they needed to go through some sort of um, period of healing and while they were going through he healing they probably were bitter I feel like somebody um, in this dynamic has a lot of pride that was hurt in a situation ego pride right here and therefore you know they may have have done something that was harsh and now they may want forgiveness so I'm not sure what this is but it feels like there's been a lack of balance in someone's life to the point where they just can't take it anymore I can't take it anymore I need to restore this balance I need to restore this hope I need to restore this this um, happiness that I once had in my life I feel as though somebody is is heading in the direction that they can't that they can't give up because it's the right thing to do I'm not sure what this is somebody has to do the right thing and they've they've come to the conclusion that I have to. I have to take charge of this situation. I do. I have to take charge of this situation. And I feel like somebody is progressing forward towards victory once they start, start taking the steps. But it feels as though someone here is, is really unhappy with how things ended. They are. They're unhappy with how things turned out with, with their... singlehood it's like the grass wasn't greener on the other side the grass wasn't greener it wasn't and I'm just looking at all this grass here grass 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 I mean there's a lot of grass there is so I think there is so I think the grass wasn't greener on the other side so I feel like somebody has come to the conclusion no it's not it's not better it's not better in this predicament it's not and now I have to and now I have to look at my life. I have to look at things from a new perspective instead of living in this place of lack and withdrawal and, 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 and bitterness. I have to look at things from a new perspective and find the courage and the confidence that I've been lacking to to move forward, to progress towards what it is that I want. So I feel as though somebody is has been unable to let go of a lost opportunity in love and perhaps now they are deciding to find their moral backbone to to take charge even if it isn't going to be pretty to deal with it it's time for me to deal with this i have to deal with this to move on i have to i have to deal with this to progress so i feel like you know there's been too much chaos too much disorder and I, I can't take it anymore. I, I, my life is not going to get better until we deal with this. So. Let me see. I'm going to get some more cards because I think that we need some. I want to know. Yeah, there's been some. There's been a breakup. There has. There's been a breakup. There's been a disconnection between two people. And, you know, it could be. You know, we have a water sign and an earth sign. And we have an air sign and a fire sign. So, you know, I'm not sure. I mean, this is Leo. So it feels like there's been some sort of disconnection that has left somebody feeling heartbroken. And somebody is deciding that, you know, I can't let go. I'm going to have to... I'm going to have to say something. I'm going to have to do something about this. I am. I'm going to have to. I'm going to have to be assertive. 
here because this loneliness isn't really serving me. Yeah, somebody is feeling like, I can't get over this loss. I, I just can't. I can't get over this loss. I have a lot of regrets. Somebody has some regrets about what happened. And I'm not sure what this is, but there is definitely some regrets here. And somebody is, is trying to bring, the, bring the, the happiness back. You know, they want the happiness back. There's been, a, there's been a breakup. There's been a breakup in which somebody is now seeing things from a new perspective. The grass is not greener on the other side. I don't want to be alone anymore. I don't want to be. I can't let this go. I'm not happy. I can't see love anyplace else. I can't see it. Therefore, somebody wants a new start. Somebody, I don't know who this is for. This will not resonate with everybody. Somebody wants a fresh start. Somebody wants a new beginning. I want to start over. I just want to start over. Can we start over? That's what this is. Somebody wants to start over. And somebody may be offering a new fresh start. They may be receiving a message, an apology that I would like to start over and not bring the past with us, not bring the baggage. I've been enlightened through this loneliness somebody has been lonely and they've been enlightened through that loneliness the thing is, is is somebody you know has has a lot of options here and i think the other person may they may see that the empress reversed is somebody that has a lot of options a lot of options but you know she has to make a head over heart decision so i feel as though Oh, there's been some sort of period where there's been no growth in your loneliness. Somebody has come to the realization that somebody has a lot of options and they need to make a decision sooner than later. <laughs> the Empress Reverse is a lack of, uh, a lack of growth. A lack of growth, a lack of healing, a lack of abundance. So, and there's a lack of abundance here as well. Somebody has been lacking inner abundance. Without this partnership, an apology is is needed, or may come. I believe there is going to be a message. There's going to be a message that is coming in regards to a lost opportunity in love where somebody withdrew, didn't communicate, and now they possibly are hoping, hoping for a new start, a fresh start. They possibly didn't see your beauty in the past. They didn't see what you were worth. But now they, now they do. Now they can't stop. Now they can't stop thinking about what they lost. I'm not sure what the hell this is. I feel like somebody is, is going to find the confidence to, to progress forward. You know, to bring, back, bring the balance back. Do whatever they got to do to bring the balance back. Um, yeah, they're thinking about... Th somebody wants to go back after they have left. Somebody is thinking about going back. Okay? They are. Because now they see the truth. They're not wearing blinders anymore. I see the truth. I do. I am no longer going to pretend or ignore the truth anymore. Somebody has been blocking their emotions for quite some time. And now, and they've delayed it for quite some time. But it feels as though that it's been overwhelming. It has. It's been overwhelming. There's been anxiety. There's been stress. There's been worry. Um, there's been emotional turmoil. And it feels as though... Somebody finally realizes through all this turmoil that they've been on how they, what they truly want. And they're thinking about going back to what made them feel emotionally content. What, which was so close to wish fulfillment. I mean, the next card is the Nine of Cups, okay? It was so close. It was so close. 
and and without this, I cannot feel abundant. I'm, somebody is feeling. I'm. I, I can't feel it. I don't feel it. Somebody is about to do the right thing, and I think I said that earlier. Somebody is about to do the right thing. That's what justice is. Justice is about integrity. Integrity, integrity. Somebody is about to do the right thing in regards to where their where their heart lies. Okay. There's been some sort of breakup that somebody wants a fresh start. I don't know who this is for. It will not resonate with everybody. Somebody may have succumbed to temptation and found that it was all lies. It was addictions. It was control. It was manipulation. It was lust. They may have succumbed to temptation and now they truly wish they hadn't. Okay. So I feel as though there's karma here. There's a karmic connection. Karmic connection in which somebody it wants a fresh start and you may be receiving a message about it. Could be today, could be tomorrow, could be the next day, could be next week. You know, we're all at different levels. Somebody is seeing the truth. They are. They've blocked it for long enough. I can't block the truth anymore. I can't. I can't. Somebody has been blocking the truth, but they're no longer about to do that. It's like, I can't block the truth anymore. If I'm looking for wish fulfillment, if I'm looking for happiness, I can't, I can't live in denial anymore. I can't. There's an opportunity for love here. Now that now this is covered, all we see is the Two of Cups. There is an opportunity for love here. If somebody would have faith and trust. Because two is their faith and trust. We have two, because the two cups, this is a two, this is a two. Somebody is about, or has restored their faith and trust, or they're working on restoring their faith and trust. I think somebody wants to apologize, and you may be receiving an apology. Because somebody has decided that it's time for me to be honest. I have to be honest. This is honest. Oh, I got two. Hello from heaven. Your loved ones in the spirit world want to connect with you as much as you want to connect with them. They know you've been thinking of them and they're sending you signs and symbols to show how much they love you to pr prove that they're with you at this time. Soul solitude. Your soul needs attention. There are moments when it's important to get away not just from the noise of the outside world, but to find a place where your soul can experience peace and quiet, a place for soul solitude. This is a time to pause, a time to reflect, and a time for you. And I feel like for many of you, this is needed, or for many of you, this has happened. Somebody has taken this time alone. I see that, and they've come to the conclusion that I'm not happy, I'm not happy, and I, and I want a fresh start. And I'm going to get you one of these or two of these angel romance cards because I feel like this is definitely a love reading. I feel like somebody is seeking balance after balance has been lost for quite some time. Balance in their life. Seeking balance. Balance has been lost. I'm sorry, I didn't see your worth. I'm sorry, I didn't see your worth. This page of pentacles with the empress. I'm sorry, I didn't see it. I didn't, I didn't realize. And now I'd like another chance. I'd like to go back. So I'm not sure who this is. I'm not sure if this, this probably won't resonate with everybody. Um, interesting. Separation, time apart from your partner is on the horizon. For some of you, this is going to happen because I'm not feeling abundant. You know what I mean? Somebody's not feeling abundant. Okay? Be careful because the grass may not be greener on the other side. Keep that in mind. Those words came out a couple times. The grass may not be greener on the side, on the other side, and you could end up regretting it. This Five of Cups is regrets over love. Somebody has some regrets, and they've come to that conclusion through solitude. Very soon, clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. Clearly decide what you want. You 
Now, this could also be a new love interest. This could be a new love interest, a new message of love. But you may not be able to accept it or see it because you are still hanging on. You could be still hanging on to your ex. Okay? Release your ex. The time has come to clear your energy. Now, this is for hundreds of thousands of people, so it's going to not it's going to be different for everybody. Okay? Some of you do need to release your ex so that, so that you can accept this offer of new love. Somebody that does have integrity, somebody that can apologize freely somebody that will see your worth somebody that isn't playing games there you some of you could be starting on a, a new journey without taking the past i mean this can go so many so many different ways somebody is heading towards wish fulfillment they are progressing very very quickly after they leave a situation But somebody wants to go back. This could go so many different ways. I feel as though somebody lacks self-love. Big time. Big time. So I'm not sure who this is for. Somebody lacks self-love. And they really need to decide what they want. They need to... And in order to do that, you are going to have to put yourself first. Stop playing games. Accept the truth. Stop lying to yourself. For many of you, this is about not wanting to be alone. I don't want to be alone. I don't want to be alone. And I want, I want this new beginning. Somebody could be taking a risk. I'm about to take a big risk. Somebody is. Somebody is about to take a big risk. And you're being called to. Have faith. Take a risk. Don't bring the past with you. Don't bring the past baggage with you. Just let it a clean slate. Somebody does want a clean slate. And you're being called to perhaps give it a whirl. Or this could be somebody new. Could be it could be somebody new. These could this, this message could be from somebody new that wants to start on a new path with you. But it feels as though somebody may not clearly even know what they want. I don't even know what I want. So this definitely has to do with love. It does. I feel like there's a lack of self-love here. The grass isn't greener on the other side, and somebody has some regrets that need to be dealt with. Um, there has been a time apart from another person that has enlightened them, okay? Has enlightened them through chaos and disorder, you know, and solitude. The chaos, the disorder, and the solitude has enlightened them, and now perhaps there is a new beginning on the horizon after this period of withdrawal so that's what I have I'm gonna stop it there like I said this could be somebody from your past which I think it is or it could be somebody new there could be a new offer coming in but you may not be able to accept it because you haven't clearly decided what you want the biggest message I get for today is clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. Clear, do the right thing, too. Do the right thing. These are both cards of integrity. Do the right thing. Clearly decide what you want. Do the right thing. Unless you want to lose this opportunity forever. Eventually, whoever this person is, is not going to be interested. She's not interested.
Anyway, that is what I have for today. I'm not sure who this is for, but that's what I got. Talk to you later.